Hey guys, ladies and gentlemen, how's everybody doing today? Happy Thursday, happy Thursday to all. We are almost there, ladies and gentlemen. We are almost there. It's almost Friday. It's almost Friday, just hang tough, hang tough. Guys, real fast, well not real, real fast, but guys, I have some canoe patterns out here that I'd like for you to see. Um, this piece here, I just got it in today. And it's just a kicker. Well, actually, I couldn't turn it down. Um, this happens to be the peach seed, their new peach seed. Um, this is their new peach seed jigged. Um, Case came out with this just recently. And this happens to be the uh, canoe. Uh, now, guys, I've heavily been getting into the canoe patterns. Um... I think I'm going to lay off them for this a little while. And this light is really shining on this thing. Um, fit and finish is pretty good on this one. You never know with case though, guys. You just never know. Um, it's just... It is just a serious... It is seriously just a beautiful piece to dump in the bottom of the pocket and carry. It's elegant. It's gentleman. Um, it's just like a gentleman's piece and I just love them. I mean That's the pattern that I just love so very much um, Hold on guys bear with me um, So that's the canoe why is that doing that? I'm trying to focus on the centerpiece, but it's my light keeps washing it out So there it is guys. I hope that you're getting just a great shot of this piece it wasn't a cheap piece, guys. She's coming in at 75 on Blade HQ. But you know something? Uh, man, for the collection, for my canoe collection, I said, you know what? Let me go ahead and do it. And it's not a big knife at all, but Jesus, Mary and Joseph, $75. They're not cheap. Let me put this down just for one minute here, guys. Um, Look what they went and did, guys. The first time... The first time in uh, history, history, they actually sent me something. Not a, not a sticker, but they sent me a little Blade HQ pin. A Blade HQ pin. I, I couldn't believe that. I couldn't believe it. First thing they ever get throw at me. What else, guys? Here's something else for you. What do you think about Smoky Mountain Knife Works putting that bombshell out last night, ladies and gentlemen? Well, what happened was when they put it out, I saw the notification went out. It was like, you got 15 more minutes. You got 10 more minutes. And then it finally came on. And there was my man Andy with the headset on. And he dropped the bombshell. And every, and I was I screamed I screamed real loud on the top of my lungs. My wife was laying, uh, just playing with the dog, petting the dog. And when I screamed, well, when I saw my favorite one, everybody has their favorites, but you know me. Holy smokes, I got to jump on that razor knife, boy. Oh! So when I saw the razor, they dropped that razor, was the first one with the, my, the denim micarta. I damn near dropped off the floor. I was standing with my... I was playing around over here at the Bureau watching it. And he he brought out the... Uh, he's like, yeah, here's the first one. It's the Razor. I was like, oh, no, he didn't. No, he just did not break that one-arm Razor out on me. And then it continued from there. My wife was like, what? She looked at me and she was like, are you serious? She's like, what is wrong with you? I said, hon, please, not right now. Please, for the sake of God, not right now. <laughs> and that was it. That was the extent of it. See you later time. Guys, we got to gobble up all three, of, all three of them. Save your pennies. Save your... Yo, know, it's coming in pretty reasonable. You know what I mean? But right now, just save your pennies. And you might as well just gobble up all three, all three of them. You know you are going to get all three. And then when they keep... Yo, know, they're going to keep coming out with them. Every so... You know how... Like the regular Rough Riders... Guys, what kind of money you got to have in your pocket for these people? And other knives that you want to buy besides the roughies? Oh, forget it. Forget it. This is just a bad deal for me. Holy smokes. I said that I was... I'm already broke. 
Oh my God, this is terrible. This is just terrible. But anyway, that was Smoky Mountain Knife Works. I can't wait till it comes down. I was ready to order it up right then. I'm waiting for it to drop. Then you got to go on the website and wait for it to come in. And then they alert you and all that. I don't know. I don't know. But I've been so busy today. Oh, man. Look at this. this I thought they were. I thought my Smoky Mountain Knife Works order was going to come in. I ordered something today, uh, last week from them. Nothing ever came in. I got to look now. Because everybody got their uh, work knives. I didn't get mine yet. My denim work knife. But, um, guys, what do you think about this canoe? Um, seriously, um, what do you think about this guy, that jigging, that's the peach, we're, that's the peach seed jigging, um, what do you think about that, guys, I'll give you a little shot of the one, the one blade open with it, man, that's just a shot, that's a stunner, isn't it, though, you should feel it in hand, you really should, transitions are all smooth, Holy smokes. I'm just now getting to it now. I was downstairs. I had work to do. I was painting. I got a lot of painting to do down there. My dogs are killing my house. I was painting trim. I was painting trim. Um, What else do I want to talk about with you guys? I don't know. I haven't been getting many comments from you. So I don't know what, what's going on. I haven't been. I get like maybe seven. All right. I'm getting like seven, maybe to ten um comments that's all i'm getting every day so we're really we're really shooting for the stars over here i got big numbers coming up over here youtube wise i'm shooting for that million dollar plaque i tell you what i'm gonna get that million dollar uh youtube plaque when i reach the million dollar uh subscriber mark oh yes i am i got that on i got that i'm focused in on that plaque absolutely I'm focused in on the YouTube plaque. Okay, well, that's... I know you guys probably don't even want to talk to me because I'm just going to cut it short. I wanted to show you this. They show me the little pin there. I don't know. What, I got to go right after this. I'm going to go on uh, Smoky Mountain Life Works. I got four. I got four nights I ordered from them uh, last week. And one of them was the denim knife. Everybody got their knife uh, except for me. Anyway, what do you think about this uh, canoe? You guys don't like the canoe. I know that. I know that. But you know something? I'm following my heart. And you know something? Guys, not for nothing. My heart's telling me. My heart is honestly telling me. Pete, stick with this traditional game. Okay? It's gonna pay dividends in years to come. In years to come. I'm following my heart. Not only with... Not only with these knives, I'm chasing these traditionals down because I have an intuition that they're going to worth, be worth big money. They're going to be worth big money, ladies and gentlemen. So, eh, I don't know. I'm just, buy, I'm just sticking with them, you know what I mean? I buy a couple moderns here and there, but as far as I'm, as far as I'm leading to believe right now, like a piece like this, years to come, this fair and forged finger. Do you think, what do you think is going to be worth money? These are about the same money. So you got the stinger here. Okay. Um, man, that's nice. You got the stinger there. That's $90. You're looking at 90 bones right there. So let's just say they're the same. With shipping, you know, you're looking at 75 for that guy. What do you think, in the long run, in the long run, is going to be worth more money years to come? Let's just say 40 years. I'm, I'm roughly, let's say 40 years from now. What brings in more money? This Fair and Forge Stinger or this Case Canoe uh, Peach Seed uh, Peach Seed? What brings in more money, guys? That's the question. 40 years from now, if these knives came up somewhere, what gets more, what fetches more money, guys? The canoe or the stinger? You just let me know. Let me know. But, um, 
I don't know, guys. Um, I don't know who that is. Well, guys, I'm going to let you go ahead and get down the road then. So, uh, let me know what's going on. And, uh, let me know, guys. Let me know about the canoe. And the Fair and Forge Stinger. Let me know which fetches more money. All right, guys. Stick with me. Take care. Be good. Be safe. Put that mask on. We're trying to get through this. If everybody puts that mask on, we'll get through it quicker than quicker than no time. All right, guys. Yo, take care. Stick with me. This is Peter. Drop me that comment. I got my seven comment, my seven people that follow me. All right, guys. Take care.